Hi, I'm Stanley Hill, and I'm excited to tell you that the 94th General Assembly of the great state of Arkansas convened today at the state's capitol. Our General Assembly, which is made up of 35 state senators and 100 members of the House of Representatives, meets in regular session every two years, and since 1875 these sessions have been convened in odd years. The good news is that this session, things are back to normal with in-person meetings and the Capitol building being open to the public again. Our team works diligently to carry out the policies developed by our grassroots process. And this session will be no different. You, our members, are key to our success. And we want you to be equipped with the information needed to be an effective advocate for our agricultural and rural interests. I urge you to please stay informed. The entire Federation staff stands ready to assist you in any way necessary for us together to accomplish our legislative goals. Mark Lambert, Director of State Affairs, is going to share our legislative priorities and other topics of interest for this legislative session. Those priorities include policies that apply to ag elementary education, affordable health benefits, boards and commissions, and taxes. We are also focused on farmers' right to operate, county and district fair funding, and critical infrastructure needs across the state. Renewable energy policy, the state meat inspection support, lemon laws, checkoff funding structure, and other issues are among our priorities as well. Our team will be engaged at the state capitol each day the General Assembly is in session and working on your behalf. During the session, we will issue legislative updates each Monday and Friday with additional updates sent out as needed. You can receive those updates by texting ARFB to 52886. In addition, please remember that our archelect.com resource is available at no charge and contains helpful information like the name of your representative or senator and their contact information. We look forward to sharing updates and going to work for Arkansas farmers and ranchers.